Hello everyone, my name is Tejas and welcome back to my channel Self Study with Tejas. And if you are passionate about mathematics and aiming to excel in the IMO exam, then you are in the right place. So today we are going to learn IMO Chapter 11 Algebra. So let's start. So Chapter 11 Algebra. Question number one: The algebraic expression for the statement one third of a number added to second multiple of six. So one third of a number is here uh, defined by y by and now add it to the second multiple of 6. So 6 to j is 12 which means our correct answer here will be option number C. Now second question when Mayank multiplies a number P by 16 and adds 5 to the product he gets Q then the value of Q is dash. So 16 into P which means 16 P and and then it, he adds 5 to it which means 16 P plus so the correct answer here will be option number A. Now third question, the algebraic expression for this statement twice the product of M and N is added to thrice of their difference is. So twice the product which means 2 M N and is added to the thrice of their difference means M minus N and it is thrice which means option number D 2 M N plus 3 in bracket M minus N. Now fourth question, the length of each equal side of an isoscale triangle is 2 times the length of its third side. If the length of the third side is y centimeter, then the perimeter of the triangle is. So, if we draw a triangle like this, this is y and this is 2 times uh, this, which means it will be 2y. And if we have to calculate the perimeter, this 2y plus 2y and this y. So 2 plus 2 is 4 and then plus 1 5 which means our correct answer here will be option number B 5 y centimeter. Fifth question an algebraic expression for 11 minus y can be written in the statement form as dash. So 11 minus y which means y less than 11. So our correct answer here will be option number B. Now sixth question which of the following equations justify the given statement. When x is divided by y the quotient is added to the product of x and y. So x divided by y and then quotient and sorry then it is added to the product which means x into y which will be xy. So correct answer here will be x divided by y plus xy. Now seventh question if a number is 12 less than 3 times x then the number is. So 3 times x means 3x and it is 12 less which means 3x minus uh, sorry uh, 3x minus 12. So correct answer here will be option number D. Now 8th question, if x is equal to 3 and y is equal to 7, then find out the value of x divided by 2 plus 4y plus 2. So first we will write the given, so x is equal to 3 and y is equal to 7. So x is equal to 3 and y is equal to 7. And now after that we have to write the questions. So x by 2 plus 4y, x by 2 plus 4y and plus so now we will put the values here. So x means 3. So 3 divided by 2 plus and now 4y. So y is equal to 7. So 7 4 j is 28 and plus 2. So which will be 30. So 3 by 2 plus 30. And now if we have to do here is no denominator which means 1. And now we have to equal the denominators which means 30 by 1 into 2 which will be 60 by 2 and 3 by 2 plus 60 by 2 will be 63 by 2. So the correct answer here will be option number A. Now ninth question Raman is twice as old as his younger sister Monica and his father is 20 years older than Raman. If the age of Raman's sister is k years then f then the algebraic expression is to find the age of Raman's father. So the age of Raman's sister sister is k years and now we have to find the age of Raman. So Raman is twice as old as his younger sister means Raman is equal to 2k years and now uh, uh, the age of uh, the age of Raman's father is 
they have said and his father is 20 years older than raman which means 2k plus 20 years so our correct answer here will be option number c now 10th question if there are 35 pencils in a pencil box then find the number of pencils in p such pencil boxes so in order to do that we have to uh, just do 35 into p so our correct answer here will be option number d now 11th question observe the pattern and find the rule that gives the number of matchsticks in ninth and uh, pattern so uh, option number a 4 n plus 1 n means the pattern so here uh, it will be 4 into 1 1 only so 4 n plus 1 so 1 2 3 4 5 so yes it will be 5 so it is here uh, means it can go here and now in the second pattern it is pattern 2 so 4 to the 8 8 plus 1 9 so here it should be 9 so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 so yes this is also going here which means uh, this is the correct answer so 12th question the breadth of a rectangle is w cm and the length is 5 times as long as its breadth what is the perimeter of the rectangle so if we draw the rectangle the breadth is w cm and the length is 5 times as long as its breadth which means it will be 5w and now they have asked the perimeter so the formula of perimeter is 2 length plus breadth which means length plus breadth we have to do first so 5w plus 1w which means 6w into 2 which will be option number b 12w cm now 13th question the number of girls in a class is 20 more than four times the number of boys if the number of boys in the class is m then what is the number of girls in the class which means uh, they they are 4 times plus 20 which means 4m plus 20 the correct answer here will be option number d now 14th question the algebraic expression for the statement product of x and reciprocal of a is subtracted from the product of y and reciprocal of b which means y by b minus x divided by a so the correct answer here will be option number a now 15th question the algebraic expression for this statement thrice of x is added to twice of y which means 3x plus 2y so the correct answer here will be option number a now 16th question if a is equal to b then ax is equal to bx which means our correct answer here will be option number b now 17th question the number of books in the first row of a bookshelf is 3 times the number of books in the second row and the number of books in the third row is five more than the twice the number of books in the first row if the number of books in the second row is n then find the number of books in the third row so first we will write the given so the number of books in the second row is n so second row is equal to n now we will calculate the first row the number of books in the first row of a bookshelf is 3 times the number of books in the second row which means if this is n it will be 3n so first row is equal to 3n and now after that if the number of books sorry here in the third row the number of books in the third row is 5 more than the twice of the number of books in the first row so uh, if this is 3n it will be 6n plus 5 which means our correct answer here will be option number b 6n plus 5 now 18th question a bus charges rupees 20 for the first kilometer and then rupees x for each subsequent kilometer find the total amount to be paid if a person travels 50 km so a bus charges rupees 20 for the first kilometer then first will be rupees 20 and then plus rupees 49 x because only for first kilometer is charges rupees 20 which means our correct answer here will be option number c So 19th question the sum of Anjali's height and Manu's height is 5.29 meter Raj is 1.01 meter taller than Manu if Anjali is x meter tall then the height of Raj is So Anjali which means x plus Manu 
is equal to 5.29 meter and now we have to calculate the height of manu so uh, which means we have to do here manu is equal to 5.29 meter minus x and now we have to calculate the height of raj and the height of raj is 1.01 meter taller than manu which means raj is equal to 5.29 plus 1.01 minus x which means it will be 6.30 minus x so our correct answer here will be option number a now 20th question observe the pattern and find the rule that gives the number of matchsticks in the nth pattern so here first it is 6n minus 2 so uh, 6n minus 2 will be 4 so 1 2 3 4 so yes it is uh, correctly working here and now in the second pattern it is pattern 2 so 6n which means it will become 12n minus 2 which is 10 so we have to count here whether it is 10 or not so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 so yes there are total 10 which means our correct answer here will be option number a now everyday mathematics question number 21 Shivang, uh, Shivangi bought x packets of candies each packet contains 25 candies if she gave 15 candies to her brother then how many candies are left with her so which means 25 x minus the candies she gave to her brother which is 15 so our correct answer here will be option number b now 22nd question Preeti travel 3 x kilometers distance by walking 9y kilometer by cycle and 5 kilometer by bus the total distance covered by Preeti is so first 3x plus 9y plus 5 kilometer so our correct answer here will be option number B now 23rd question Kirti sold 4c cupcakes her brother Dishang sold 3 more cupcakes than Kriti. how many cupcakes they both sell together so he sold three more which means he al also sold 4c cupcakes so 4c plus 4c will be 8c and then he sold three more which means 8c plus 3 so our correct answer here will be option number b so 24th question sanjay had x eggs he used eight eggs to bake a cake and seven eggs were broken which expression shows the number of eggs left with him so eight plus seven is 15 and he had sx so if we subtract it we will get the number of x left with him which means s minus 15 so the correct answer here will be option number c now 25th question jaya's score in mathematics is 30 more than two third of uh, of her score in english if her score in english is x then which of the following expression shows her score in mathematics so two third of of means multiply which means 2x by 3 and she has scored 30 more which means 2x by 3 plus 30 so our correct answer here will be option number b now achiever section question number 26 ashima bought 23 things from the market she bought five more jeans than shirt two fever watches than jeans and rest are caps if x represents the number of shirts in total then which mathematical expression can be used to find out how many caps are brought so we can say that uh, sorry shirts is equal to x and now she bought five more jeans than shirts so jeans is equal to x plus five and now after that two fewer watches than jeans so watches is equal to x plus five minus two which means x plus 3 and now and rest are calves so now we have to uh, subtract all of these from 23 which means 23 minus plus x minus in bracket x plus 5 and minus in bracket x plus 3 so our correct answer here will be option number a and now 27th question if nakul's present age is x years then the uh, then after five years his age will be dash years 
so it will be x plus 5 which means our correct answer will be from option number b or c now second 8 more than 2 times the number of x can be written in algebraic form as so 8 more than 2 times the number of x which means 2x plus 8 which means our correct answer here will be option number b now 28th question read the given statements carefully and select the correct option statement 1 there are 6 bags containing 3 packets of rice in each bag if the weight of each packet of rice is wkg then the total weight of rice in all 6 bags is 9 wkg so 6 3 is 18 and each packet of rice is wkg which means it should be 8, uh, 18 wkg not 9 wkg so this is false and now after that the number of hours in n weeks is 168 n so 24 into 7 is 168 which means this is true so our correct answer here will be option number d statement 1 is false but statement 2 is true now 29th question state t for true and f for false so if x is equal to 15 and the value of 41 minus x is 27 so 41 minus 15 is 26 not 27 so this is false now after that u if each side of a square is a centimeter then the area of the square is a into a centimeter square so yes this is correct now a third one x exceeds y by 7 can be expressed as x is equal to y by 7 so yes this is also correct which means false true true so the correct answer here will be option number a so 30th question match the following first one the total weight of three boxes is 5 kg if the weight of two of the each boxes is x kg each then the weight of the third box bracket in kg is dash so the weight of two boxes is x kg which means 2x and the total weight is 5 kg which means 5 minus 2x so first one will go to c now second sid has x trophies he ate five trophies and gave six trophies to her neighbor the number of trophies left with him is dash so x and 5 plus 6 is 11 which means x minus 11 so second will go to A and now third one Mohit had rupees X. He gave the money to his uh, three sisters equally. Each girl will get X by 3 which means this will go to B. So C, A, B. So our correct answer here will be option number A. So if you liked our video please like share and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.